Oh, mate, you're right. Where are you going there? Yeah. You're right. Little, uh, little eight pounder. <laughs> nice. How you doing, alright? Yeah, not too bad. Not Down to middleweight yet? That's when we'll... You actually look like you. I'm uh, getting scared. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Yeah, look at his yeah. face. Looks like he's ready to fight. I'm trying to get down there. Well, you, you. He wants a date. Yeah. You gonna give him a date October, live here now? Twenty seven. Possibly Newcastle. Or London. That'd be nice. Either London. Either either thirteen or twenty seven. That's what we said earlier. One one fight at middleweight. Eight rounder. Yeah. And then balls deep. Yeah. It's got to be in it. Yeah, yeah. He ain't got time to mess around. Just have to stop yeah, eating well now, won't I? Well, it's still going to be a struggle for you to make middleweight, but you got to do it yeah, yeah. because you ain't a super middleweight. Nah, nah, nah. That's for sure. All you got to do is get on the Coogan Cassis diet, right. <laughs> and you'll be fine. Who do you want? Who would you rather that big fight be? A middleweight. Yeah. But look at the division; it's unbelievable. Hmm. The Bruy, well, we just made two well. world title fights in two weeks. Jacobs Derevenchenko, Saunders Andrade. But even domestically, I would quite like him to look at the winner of Langford against Wellborn. He's a good fight for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's on the calm fight. That was fight of the year, last fight. Mm. That's going to be a brilliant rematch. Even above that, you've got loads of middleweights domestically, young kids coming through. Ultimately, for Jamie, he's at a stage in his career where he has one fight to get comfortable at the weight, and then he has to fight anybody domestically. Because he don't, he don't want to hang around. He's been in big fights already. There's mm. no, no point treading water. Even the eight rounder is a pain in the ass, but it has to be done because he has to have a fight around that weight first, rather than just diving in, in my opinion. So. Okay. There we go. We'll see what happens then. Definitely that middleweight, so let's give it a go and see what it's about. Look for some big fights. You down look there. the same now. You don't look far off what you were fighting at super middle. No. Nah, what what are you weighing now? About just over twelve and a half now. Exactly. Yeah. So. And what are you weighing then? Yeah, 18, five, something like that. You lost a pound since, since earlier I on. pulled that fish in. <laughs> was I 18.6 earlier? Yeah. After, I told you, did I tell you that weight bet I'm doing? No. Well, I told you that. Oh, with your family? Everyone's got to lose a, lose pound, a pound a week, a week. weighing yeah. every Monday for 14 weeks. And you've got to do it. If I can do a stone, that'd be nice. In a month. But you look like you've put on a little bit. Hey, Riley, you need to join in on this, don't you? Yeah. What have you been put on a little bit? Loss. You've put on a bit of weight. You don't look as gaunt in your face as you have done. Mm, I'm 15, 11. Wow, that's unbelievable. Mm. You have no legs, though. Le legs no are legs. getting worked on. My legs are huge. Frank's legs are huge. Frank's legs are huge. Frank Smith, by yeah. the way. No, I haven't seen Warren's legs. <laughs> no, but we're talking <laughs> about Frank Smith. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, but you have got small legs. Yeah. Fighters, sometimes you have to look at their legs. John Ryder has got massive legs. That's why he's all right at super middleweight. I'll tell you he's got massive legs. Kel Brook, he's got massive legs. Okay. Anyone else's legs you want to... Check out a lot of legs. Prince Naz had it. He had big legs. What about you, mate? Ian, yeah, he's got a fair set on him. <laughs> but you do have no legs, don't you? Yeah. Are you do I didn't realise, I saw on your Instagram that you're weightlifting. You're doing weights. Mm. I didn't know that. Mm. Only for the last three months. Fucking check you out. Leave off. <laughs> so I saw that, that picture you posted, which was one of the cringiest things I've ever seen. Why? With the headphones on around here, going, like pushing you, pushing you, yeah. giving it that one with Why your not? biceps. What, was it more Gym or less? time. Was it more or less cringier than. No, 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 no. But the difference is, mate, what? If you're talking about the, the dance on the boat, I didn't film that. I didn't even know it was. Being yeah, of course great. you didn't. The difference is, you've you gone didn't. to a mirror. With a vest on. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just put these headphones around. Do you know what? That's double call. Cool. You're a proper prick, you are. Well, I'll tell you, you why. Can't take it. I'll you tell you why. Because you're the only one that's hating on it. No, mate. You are. You're the only one that's hating on it. No, I'm the only one who's telling you. I'm no, hating. you're the only one Trust hating me. on it. Trust me. No, Do you, you know how many people saw that Instagram post and went, what a prick? Yeah, what, you? No. <laughs> what, you? Others will go, others will tweet you and go, oh, Coogie, it's so great to see you in great physical condition losing weight. Fair play to you, mate. You really deserve it. And then they go, what a prick. I'll just tell you to your face, because I'm oh, your mate. Okay, no worries. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> What's my next post? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Eddie Ham, Sammy Cheers, Cox, mate. thank you very much for talking yes. to IFL TV, and uh, we'll see what else you catch yeah. today. I'm in the running. You are. Have we got a live one, Ed? We've got a live one, mate. This is an IFL exclusive. And then tip that way because it's going towards you, mate. That's it. Bit Funny time. if it was the same one. <laughs> no, it will be. Do you remember its name? <laughs> we'll ask him. It, it might not be a carp, this one, the way it's coming in. It might be a bream. 
Oh, now Breen. See Breen. That's enough line, now right. play your fish. It's quick, isn't it? Well, I say, once you can get them going, you can get a lot of fish. Oh, oh my god. You let have a bit of that line, that's all. Never mind. It's only a tiddler though, I think. What sort of weight do you think that was? You, you've got to keep tight line on it, you see. Oh. Do you have any in the next away? No, we threw it back. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. weight. Oh, I can't believe it. Devastated. <laughs> it's only a tiddler though, I think. What do you reckon? Yeah, it's not as big as the other one. No. So you failed, yeah? Alright, mate. Thank you. Alright, thanks, Ed. Don't put that one out, yeah? No. <laughs>